Hi guys, hope you're all doing well. I'm just going to show you what I'm making for dinner. This is a small little rice cooker I have. You really can't make that much rice in it. But for me, it's perfect because it's only my husband, uh, my daughter and I, so we get plenty of rice for our meal. So I'm using a small one. And um, again, I'm not even going to tell you how much rice I'm using. Um, actually, I can tell you. I want to show you is how I make a very easy Persian dish, fast and easy, without having all the stress of using either a tagine or having to cook your lentils. Uh, basically, you could get some cooked lentils that are either in a can or a jar. Uh, here we go. I've got some beautiful lentils here. They're already cooked for me. And uh, I'm going to use this, the rice, and some seasoning. And you have a perfect side dish or a perfect meal. So I'm going to show you how simple this is. Okay, Erica, you want to rinse those out for me? Okay, we're going to start off with cutting an onion. And I'm not going to use butter, but I will use olive oil to cook the onion. And one onion is more than enough, but you want to cut them in, in slivers. And how thin or how thick is really up to you. And this is basically a rice and lentil dish with some fried onions. And the onions are cooked with a little bit of cinnamon. It is really, really good. Now, if you don't like the cinnamon, you can leave it out. But it really adds to the dish. Now, because I don't have, um, I don't have any raisins, I'm going to be using just a little bit of date. But just a little, just to add a little sweetness to the dish. So I'm going to put this in a frying pan. I'm going to put some olive oil. So I'm going to cook these and I'm just going to show you when I throw everything together what it looks like. So I'm just going to put this to cook. Uh, we're going to add some cinnamon. Okay, we're going to add a little bit of chili bar because we like it. We're going to add some cinnamon. And really it is up to you how much you want to use. We're going to put a little bit of cardamom. We're going to put just a little bit of black pepper. There you go. And we're going to fry this up. So I'll show you what it looks like in a bit. You know what? I'm going to actually use two onions. While that's starting to cook, I'm just going to cut up this other onion. And then I'll show you when I put it together. It's really simple. You really don't have to do much. You're basically throwing your ingredients together. And you just have to cook uh, your rice. Uh, your rice and your onion. Then what you could do is if you want it as a warm dish, you can heat it up again by putting it into the oven. Or you can mix everything together and just eat it as a side dish. So that's it. I'm just going to cook this up and I'm going to show you when I put it together. I'm going to just cut up a couple of dates, remove the pits. Now you can either, uh, what you could do is you could either uh, throw it in with the onions when you're cooking this or you can just um, put it on top of the dish or in between the dish without cooking it with the onion. And you don't want too much because you really don't want a super sweet dish. You just want that surprise bite. Here you go. As you can see, they're cooking. I've got the date, all the seasoning, and the onions. And I'm just going to cook this slowly till they get nice and brown. Okay. 
I have a little bit of saffron that I'm going to use in my rice. I'm going to throw it right into my rice while it's cooking. And that's going to add some added flavors to my rice. Just want to show you. There we go. We've got the saffron in with the rice as it cooks. And we're going to mix this and make it as a side dish rather than a complete meal. But again, if you don't want this as a side dish, you can simply just add, um, make it a meal rather than a little side dish for yourself. So here's our beautiful lentil. How fast was that? I didn't even have to cook it. So if you can, do try and buy it in the jar because that metal stuff isn't really good for us. So uh, if you could get some lentil. Uh, try and get it in jars and not cans. Okay, here's a beautiful onions. I didn't overcook them because uh, I rather have them where they're still a little tender and you can see all the little bits of dates and it just smells so wonderful. It's got such a nice warm, uh, warm smell to this dish uh, with the cinnamon and the cardamom. It's just so wonderful. So I'm going to wait and show you how I mix everything together. We're going to add some salt. Now it looks like a lot of salt, but it really isn't because once the rice goes in, it's not going to be that much. Now, if you like I said, if you're making this as a side dish, you don't have to reheat the, the lentil. You could just mix everything together. But even with the, the hot rice, it's going to heat up the lentil for you. But if you're having it as a meal, what you could do is maybe layer it, put it in the oven, and then serve your dish. What I'm doing is I'm also putting just a little pinch of black seeds. Now, these seeds are just amazing. They have a little, almost like a little onion, um, onion taste to it. And it just has a little burst of flavor every time you get one in your mouth and very simple to uh, they're just called black seeds so if you ever go to an Iranian store or um, for sure you can find them there and it's just called black seeds so that's what I'm using in here they really do have a nice little burst of flavor when you bite into one This really is a very simple dish. Powerhouse. Here's all the protein you need. People are so worried about where you're going to get your protein. But lentils are very high in protein. So if you get a chance, try and make this dish. Okay, here we go. The rice is done. And I'm just going to add a little at a time. And I will mix it together. Gonna mix a couple of onions in there. Now you don't have to mix them into the rice, you could actually just leave them out and you can put them right on top of your dish. And that's how simple this dish is. Taste it for salt. See if you need to add extra salt. Lentil, rice, fried onion with some nice cardamom and cinnamon. 
And if you find you want it a little extra, just by all means, go ahead and add it. Really, really good. You need some extra olive oil. And that is Hubby's dinner. Very simple, guys. So if you like this recipe, give me a thumbs up, and I'll see you in the next one.